<sighs> yes, past me, save! Save if your life depended on it! And it will. Anyway, uh, hey guys, this is SMX, and welcome back to uh, Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep. With me as always... This is Yuri. And, uh, FanWing93, how's it going, guys? We're going to... Oh, you're talking to the audience. Sorry. Damn, rhetoric. Right yeah, who did you think I was talking to? <laughs> Your imaginary friend? Imaginary friend? What? Okay. What? Real men have imaginary friends. Isn't that right, Dave? <laughs> Say hello! Avi. Uh, Oh, I'm sorry, my imaginary friend got adopted at Foster's. I'm bad. Uh, that's ironic because I'm not really that big of a fan of that show, believe it or not. Yeah. I was kind of like, I was one of those people, like, it was on, I was kind of like, whatever, I'll just watch it because it's Which is weird because, like, which is weird because Foster's has a really big fan base, at least from what I know. Yeah. It's a mind fucky thing, I'll tell you that. Yeah. But, yeah, we can all agree the show was... Okay! It was... It was... <laughs> the show that every critics agreed to be... Okay! <laughs> okay, anyway, let's fight more of these emotions. Because we're emo. <laughs> this is why no one has emotions! We're all fighting them. We should be friends and have... Well, the bad emotions out. It's so emotional! What the hell? I, I promise I won't cry. <laughs> it's so sad a story since Bambi! <laughs> right, well there was another that was another uh D-Link action. Yeah. Yeah. And so we're heading down this hallway with no freaking people! So we're de audi so we're going down to the audience chamber, which obviously does not have an audience. It just has like a solitary- Or a king or, king or queen. Or yeah, a lash. Take out the unburst! Which looks like a bicycle. Actually, okay. it's a spindle. See what they did there, guys? See? Yeah. They're sleeping beauty! And okay. Snake <laughs> <I got laughs> wing! <laughs> Ow. Dude, don't let the spindle hit you in the face. But it's so spiny and prickly and... Ah. Uh, wow. What Damn. the hell? Is it... Is it... Really? It's it's attacking you with yarn? Yes. No, I think this spindle... should have been a Kirby's Epic Yarn boss. This is like a possessed Rumpel Stiltskin boss. Now see, that's something I never generally got. What is, um... Well, because, like, I actually never read the story as when I was younger, but what is Rumpelstiltskin about? Uh... The girl who's supposed to spin straw into gold because her dad's a freaking liar. Mm -hmm. She's like, you can't do this! And then this imp comes in and like, Hey! I'll spin straw into gold for you! You just gotta pay me something! So she pays him, like, her necklace and her jewelry, and he spins the straw into gold for her. The king becomes a bigger dick as time goes on. But a third night... He gives her, like, all this straw, and she's like, Okay, I've got nothing to give you. And Rumpelstiltskin's like, Okay, give me your firstborn kid. And she's like, What? Oh, and wow. She, and he's like, You heard me. And she's like, Fine. So they do it. They get married. She has the baby. And then Rumpelstiltskin's like, Okay, okay, you're being whiny about it. I'll give you three days, and if you don't guess my name, you can, like, I'm going to take away your kid. But if you get my name, you can have the kid. So Okay, then. Yeah, so they spend all the time guessing names, but then like a third, like a hunter is out, then he goes to her, and it's like, Hey, you know that creepy old man who keeps coming to your house? I know his name! I overheard him singing it while he was cooking! And... I die! Really? You yes! died on the first boss? It gets even more pathetic as the game goes on, people. Nice. Bravo, Rico! You can do it, Rico! Bike his freaking head off! You can do it! I do it on this try, though. I just thought it'd be funny. <laughs> Meh. <laughs> but yeah, anyways, yeah, the hunter tells, you know, her, like, the name. And so he comes back, and the first few plays, Cow Stupid, like, Is your name Bill? Is your name Will? Oh, wait, I got it! Your name's Rumble Stiltskin! And Rumble Stiltskin's like, Fuck! And based on the variations, he either rips himself in half, or he flies away oh. and talks to him again. The end. 
That was story time with Danny, everyone. I hope everyone enjoyed it. Yes, I know fairy tales because I'm an English major and I need to study them. Oh, yeah, that's right. You take care of that medieval piece of crap. Stuff. <laughs> oh my gosh, he's almost down. He's almost down. You got it. You got it. Last bar. Oh Ow. shit. Dude. I know, I suck. Leave me alone. <sighs> Leave Rico alone! It's not my fault, I get it. I, actually, no, uh... Actually, yeah, this is actually the only boss I failed on in my first playthrough. Wow. In, like, my first playthrough, this was the only boss I failed on. Okay, never mind, I answered my own question. In the second playthrough, though, I failed on many other bosses. That's just sad. I know, isn't it? Wah, 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 wah. Wait, what are, oh shit. Dude! Come on! Attack! 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 There we go. Yeah, yeah, that's right, you use your shot locks like a man. I'm a man! Punch! Where are punch? Let's see, ow. No, I think he has multiple things that you can actually hit that have different bars of health. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, he has the wheel and the actual spindle thing. Okay. Cheater! Cheater, 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 cheater! Oh, jeez. Kingery, I mean, real! Cheater! Okay, we need to make up our own joke. Yeah, we do. There really. you go. Yeah! I learned Diamond Dust. <laughs> do, 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 do. Okay. Your deck capacity is I learned how to get, get to the Diamond Dust Zone, guys. <laughs> how did you do that? Did you go to Jared? <laughs> uh. Oh, well. If anyway. that's all that her light was stolen. It was because I was it's weak. No, it's because you were possessed. I'm sorry. What's wrong with you? There's a difference. Get your light back. Once I learned to stand up against the darkness. Yeah, once I learned to solve my own problems, then I'll come and Why save you. Why would Master say in order to imprison the? Yeah, because apparently I'm hotter than Prince Philip. So the a bunch of fangirls will wring my neck. Uh, Do they hold the answer? Do they hold the answer? Not for not for another ten years. They won't. Sorry, dude. Seven Nothing pure personal. Hearts, each completely void of darkness. Yes, apparently you can hear me, even though I'm on the tallest Such tower. A search may take some time. Ten years, to be exact. <laughs> I'll be back. <laughs> I gotta go to the bathroom. <laughs> Fairy stars, a keyblade I will never use in this in this uh, in Terra story. Why? Because it'll turn your outfit blue. <laughs> no. No, uh, it, it actually provides more of a boost to magic, and since Terra is not a magic user... Touché. So where are we going? Oh, no! We're, we're going to the Dwarf Woodlands, everybody! No! Uh, until the world, that actually, the world that actually has my favorite music, actually. Oh. Until then, see ya. Adios. I love how we just cut off at the end. Uh...